PSR chassis brace kit today. Um, as you can see, I've already had it on there once quickly and marked out. But you got to take all the brake line bolts and clamps off. You got to clean the chassis right up, so I just traced it out quickly and put some G clamps on. There's a bracket at the front here I got to grind off. I think that little bracket's meant for like a brake hose or something. I don't know. So we'll just grind it off and see, but yeah, we'll sort of do a bit of a tutorial video, time lapse or something, so keep you interested. sort of see there clamped it on nice cleaned it up I did run the sander wheel over the plates themselves just make it a bit easier so what I'll do is I'll tack that one and then move the clamps and sort of just keep clamping it nice and tight to the chassis so I might just a few tacks in the middle, then move that middle clamp down to underneath, tack underneath, and then yeah, move to that plate and to that plate. So we'll keep going.
lot of this uh, chassis brace on. It's a PSR kit. Um, had to upgrade welders because uh, my good old welder finally tacked it. So I'm using a 200 amp, no, 220 amp. Uh, world master of a friend of mine's let me borrow it. And I've got it set on probably about nine out of the 12 settings and it gets some nice good penetration welds with it. And it's a 100% duty cycle, so I could just keep going. So that's it for the chassis brace kit. I'm just going to wax some edge primer on it now, and then a bit of stone guard later, and I'll push it outside for the stone guard. So as you can see, it comes up to the front there on both sides, and all the way to the back. So you can get another kit with them as well, which extends on the outside, but personal preference really. I didn't decide, I didn't have the extra money and hence now I've got to go buy a new MIG. But oh well, time for bigger and better things. So thanks for watching uh, and like and subscribe please. Thank you.